absolutely slaps. We've only got 20 seconds left, so let's just listen to the rest. Oh, well, that happened fast. <laughs> Hi, everyone. How's it going? Happy Monday. Hi, hi. What's Sam doing in Montreal? He is uh, visiting the For Honor team. So he's never been to Canada. He's very excited. Um, hopefully he'll do all of the classic things. <laughs> do you miss Sam yet? Of course I do. Even last night, we went to a movie last night um, because my parents are in town, so we were able to go on a date. We went to uh, see Spider-Man last night, and uh, and I was like, I'm going to miss you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was good. I liked it. I also thought that it was funny that um, I got my parents to watch Enter the Spider-Verse, and then we watched Spider-Man later the same day. It's, like, it's a, just a Spider-Man day, you know. Did you change your setup? Um, not for a while, but if you haven't been here in a while, then... I saw Spider-Man last night, too. Fucking... It was in the wind. Did you get him a plaid shirt? Um, being an Oregonian, I have bought him many a plaid shirt, but he does not wear them. <laughs> How was parents visiting? I mean, they're still here. They're here until Wednesday. Thank goodness, because otherwise uh, it would be a week of me being like, no stream, guys. <laughs> I have no one to watch the baby, so... How are you liking Ensemble Stars? Oh, I got um, 0.5 episodes into that and stopped. I did not enjoy it. <laughs> I've lived in Oregon four years now. When do I get my complimentary plaid shirt? Oh, you have to go to the nearest thrift store and get your first plaid shirt that way. It's that bad. Um, I just don't. I just didn't enjoy it. It was really hard for me to watch, so. Oh, dumb Alex, that's nice. Yeah, I showed my mom the Picard trailer and we were both like, yay, Picard. Yeah, Zico, I feel you on that. So there's like one funny fight scene. I didn't even get to that. I didn't even get to that scene. I don't know. It just, I, out of everything that I've watched this season, that was the one show where I was like, I don't enjoy this at all. <laughs> Data and Riker will be in it. It is great. Yo, I can't believe you're glossing over frickin' Seven of Nine in the trailer. <laughs> Voyager is relevant. <laughs> haven't caught the Picard trailer. You should watch it. It's very good. It made me very happy. I started watching Natsume Jincho with my girlfriend. It's like eating a marshmallow with a spoon made of honey. It's so wholesome. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? It's very cute. What? I find value in every Star Trek. So... 
when people are like, Voyager sucks or Deep Space Nine sucks. To be fair, I didn't watch a ton of Deep Space Nine, but it surprises me when people write off an entire like section of Star Trek. They're all great. Look, I even, I've gone back many a time to rewatch the original series. And it's like, look, it's not great, but I still love it. <laughs> I still love it just for what it is, you know? Yeah, Next Generation was was like I think the most prominent one in my life like original series wasn't really a thing by the time I was like born and growing up but my dad watched a lot of um next generation and then um Voyager was on fairly often but Deep Space Nine was kind of hit or miss like we didn't we didn't like really watch it that much Picard or Kirk. Picard is a much better captain. I think we can probably all agree about that. In terms of like personality, like who they are, I love them both. But I think Picard is a better captain. I shouldn't put words in your mouth. I shouldn't say we can all agree Picard is a better captain. That's fine. I'm not going to put words in your mouth, but Picard is a better captain. <laughs> I still haven't watched Orville. Some people like it and some people do not like it. Do you guys want to say hi to Clark? She's with she's with her Nana right now. But Nana might like a, a little reprieve. Yeah. Add some add add some more positivity. <laughs> Marky, did you want to see the head Daddy just left for Canada. We just got up from a nap. Oh. She woke up at like six. So she went down for a really early nap. She was having like a meltdown while Sam was trying to say goodbye to her. And we were like, well, maybe she'll wake up from her nap. <laughs> Don't push it in your eyeball. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. We were like, maybe she'll wake up from her nap before you leave. And then your last interaction with her won't be her, like, scream crying at you. And she did. She woke up right as he was about to walk out the door. And he was like, I'm going to go get her. <laughs> it was very cute. Huh? What are you doing? What are you doing? Clarky, a lot of us are bummed today. We've had some sad news in the last couple of days, but you're normally a, a beacon of fun and happiness. <laughs> he says, she's like, 
I could take another nap. Oh, honey. Yeah. This is pretty wholesome, too, if we're being real. Cutie pie. Do you want to go back to Nana? Aw. Want to go back? Walk with her. Can you let me know? Yeah. No. I can bring her back. Everybody say, hi, Mom. <laughs> they won't be able to see you. Unless hi. you want them to. It's my mommy. <laughs> it's Nana. Can you see me? Okay. okay. Mm. All right. I love you. Mwah. Bye, mommy. Bye, bye. Have fun working. Bye, bye. Love you. Be good to Nana, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Some good, wholesome stuff for all of us. <laughs> I saw the news about Jeff, and then I watched Sea of Solitude. Oh, no. I described that game in detail to my mom last night. Um, and she was like, wow, that sounds like a really cool game, but like a really intense game. I was like, it was. <laughs> yeah, that was three generations. That was three generations of us all on the screen at once. <laughs> hmm. Jimmy, what's up, dude? Hi, everybody. Would you recommend Sea of Solitude? Yes. It is very emotional, though. Like, it is an extremely emotional game. I've never... The pitch that I've given a couple of people now that is effective... Uh, for giving them the kind of idea of what sort of game it is, is that I've never felt like I was gonna sob the way that I felt while I was playing that game. Like, I had to take a break and walk away to let myself just sob for a while. Um, and I've cried on stream, for sure. But that was, like, another level, it felt like. It's just very well done. It's really well put together. Um, everybody is believably complex. Um, as as like they should be in a game that's that's about that's about like people's mental states, right? Which is like the whole the whole game. Um, so. What game is this? It's called Sea of Solitude. It's really good. Um, it's on Origin. And um, it's the game that they, they did a trailer two E3s ago. And I remember seeing the trailer and being like, oh my god, this game looks like my shit. 100%. Uh, it's the game where you're like kind of a, a monster. Like a monster girl that's in a boat getting chased by shit in the water. Um but they pitched the game as this is a, a game where you sort of explore like elements of um, depression and, and all kinds of things like that. So the game, the game is really interesting and really well done and I think develops like the layers of what's happening really well. Oh, Jimmy, thank you so much for gifting subs, dude. If you were gifted a sub by Jimmy, be sure to say thank you. It's very sweet of you, dude. And it was your nine months, so happy Twitch, baby. <laughs> oh, and Arnar, thank you very much as well. Thanks, guys. That's very sweet. That's very generous. Okay, I'm going to close the door.
And then um, we're going to play Night Call today because for the last, like, what, three co-optional podcasts, I've been like, Night Call, Night Call, Night Call, Night Call, Night Call. And then I was, <laughs> was complaining to my parents this morning. I was like, I can't believe how many people have messaged me saying, Jesse found this really cool game called Night Call. You should try it. And I was like, I found that game. <laughs> how dare you? <laughs> Avi, thank you for also gifting subs. Aw, if you were gifted a sub today, be sure to check who it was. Say thank you. It's very generous of you guys. Thanks so much. <laughs> and Jimmy gifted more. Thank you. Thank you, dude. That's very sweet, guys. No, Potato, thank you for gifting subs. Guys, you don't have to you don't have to battle. You don't have to gift sub battle. It's okay. <laughs> Is this secretly a subathon? It's not, I swear. I was just gonna play some night call and show you my baby to cheer everybody up. That's that was my whole plan today. <laughs> Potato, thank you so much for gifting subs. If you were gifted a sub by Potato, be sure to say thank you. Avi, thank you so much for more subs as well. Oh, David. David, thank you for gifting subs. Gynax, thank you for gifting subs. Kendra, thank you for gifting subs. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. That's so sweet of you guys. Let's go. No, it's fine. Don't do this. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much. If you were gifted a sub, I know I keep saying this, but seriously, like, when people are, are this generous in chat, I want to make sure that they're, that they're told thank you and appreciated for it. Jimmy, thank you so much. And Sonic Advance, thank you so much. Both of you gifted subs at the same time, so you're... um. Your uh, announcements were mixed together. It was a beautiful amalgamation. Thank you, guys. And Bromanity, thank you so much for gifting subs as well. Oh, guys. <laughs> this reminds me of when Sam said Clark's feet are cold. They could be warmed by socks. Sub today to buy Clark's socks. Yeah, when I followed up with, she has socks, guys. I swear she has socks. <laughs> They're gifting subs so that you won't get up and leave. I'm just going to close the door. That's all I was going to do. Baby needs socks. She's got socks, I swear. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you very much. It was very sweet. Could you hear what song I was singing? And if so, um, post it in chat. Thank you. <laughs> Avi, thank you for gifting subs. Potato, thank you for gifting subs. <laughs> You didn't realize, but it was a test. <laughs> it was not the Spider-Man theme song, no. <laughs> I can do it again and try to sing the words at the same time. I'll probably be even more out of breath, but... <laughs> <laughs> is that your exercise for the day yeah part of me literally part of me was like yo if i do this for long enough i'll have raised my heart rate to the perfect level <laughs> okay ready i took my buffalo to the store got his head stuck in the door spilled some lima beans on the floor oh everybody's got a water buffalo <laughs> 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 
it's um <laughs> it's, it's an old veggie tales song wait i'll find it hold on i'm gonna find this song oh my god here it is and now it's time for silly songs with laddie the part of the show where laddie comes out and sings a silly song so without further ado silly songs with laddie You're welcome. If you've never heard that song before, uh, it is a blessing. <laughs> it is a blessing in your life. You're welcome. <laughs> mm. uh, anyways, <laughs> thanks for all the gifted subs, guys. <laughs> Let's play Night Call. <clears throat> You've ruined my week. <laughs> it's sure something, all right. Mm. Look, I mean, if you if you want to also watch the video, I'm going to go ahead and leave that to you. Oh, play? Oh. 